Towson Field Hockey suffering a tough loss in their home opener today at Johnny United Stadium, falling 6-2 to Providence. We are with head coach Michelle Weber. Coach, um, just your assessment of the game and uh, what made things difficult today? Finishing. You know, this this is on our forwards. You know, we got to figure out a way to put the ball in the back of the goal, especially when you have numbers up situation. And our forwards haven't figured out how to finish opportunities, and that's what we've got to focus on from here on out. Because so far this season, we've had that same issue. And it's coming slowly, but we've got to figure that out. In the first half of, uh, of today's game, one shot, one goal. Um, you mentioned forwards not being able to, to finish enough. In the second half, more shots, not as many goals. So do you see improvement already just in the second half with what you were talking about? Yeah, we, 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 we made some changes system-wise, and it's getting better. The effort and energy that we played with was a goal that we set today was to make sure that we, we kept that up 70 minutes, and they did. You know, they did a great job with that. Um, but at the end of the day, you've got to score more than any other team, and you got to keep more of the goals out of your back of your goal as well. And we are, we are not doing really well on both of those ends. So it's something we've got to, you know, it's a young team, and we've got to be patient. But I think the upperclassmen, seniors are getting frustrated, and as a head coach too, we're, we're all getting frustrated with that. But it's going to come. Yeah, we're trying to be patient, but time's running out. <laughs> um, maybe maybe a little case of tired legs a little bit today playing uh just yesterday on the road at bucknell and you know the travel schedule and then having to come out here for an afternoon game did it seem like the legs were an issue at all uh for the majority of the game no i think near the end with about five minutes to go or main starters you know like megan penza kelly madeline you know they started seeming a little bit tired but we, you know we kept rotating everybody in and out to keep them fresh and i think the energy was kept up because of that rotation Overall, I think they, you know, they're fit. You know, they trained well this summer and they came back in shape, and that didn't really show as much today. Mm -hmm. And lastly, do you feel like so long as that that energy and effort is there, that this team will be able to break through and 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 end this frustrating start? Yes. Uh, you know, if we we put together 70 minutes like we did today, because they played all the way through to the end, it, it's going to be great once they figure it out. And the frustration will be alleviated, hopefully in the near future. <laughs> Coach, thanks for taking a little time with us. Thank you. Hey, Tiger Town, be a part of the uproar and get your Towson football tickets today. See the Tigers take on the St. Francis Red Flash at the homecoming game sponsored by Under Armour, Saturday, September 22nd at 7 p.m. in Johnny United Stadium. Enjoy the excitement of Tiger football as we welcome back Tiger alumni and crown the 2012 homecoming king and queen. It's the Tigers homecoming game against St. Francis, September 22nd at 7 p.m. in Johnny United Stadium. For tickets, visit TowsonTigers.com or call 1-855-TU-TIGER. Don't miss out.